Good evening, boys and girls. Uh, this is Shadi, just bringing you another uh, episode of uh, Liverpool FC and Vancouver Whitecaps Fan TV. Uh, the match between uh, Liverpool and Roma just ended, and the match ended at 5 2 in Liverpool's favour. Um, <clears throat> you know what? I'm just going to get straight into it. Uh, the first 20 minutes. Um, Roma was all over us, you know, like they played Liverpool style. They had they, they Liverpooled us, right? They bossed us around for 20 minutes and then this game just ch changed and here comes Liverpool blitzkrieg, you know, with uh, Mane, Firmino and Salah. And we go up and uh, we play brilliantly today. Uh, five goals uh, in quick successions, uh, two, two goals are... Uh, uh, before the half time and then scoring three uh, in the second half we played quite well today I'm just a little disappointed with us conceding so late in the last 10 minutes where we conceded two goals but nonetheless we played well uh, it just goes to show that uh, uh, one person's mistake can affect the whole team and that's what happened we were sailing quite well you know we are doing quite well against Roma we had them the um, defense of Roma they were at sixes and sevens they they were, were stunned um, the, the coach was shouting uh, Francesco was shout, shouting instructions to them on, uh, from the side but you know you, you, when you looked at this team uh, Roma team they were defeated but one mistake from one of our players, and that was Lovren. Uh, again, it was Lovren, and he caused the first goal, and then the second goal came because the momentum was on Roma's side. But nonetheless, we won. We won 5-2. We take it into Roma next week in eight days' time. It's going to be a good match. It's a three-goal uh, difference, but they got the two away, away goals, so that makes things a little bit more interesting. So the game... the, the the, the tie is not dead and over it's still everything to play for and i think roma going into it they're gonna play hard they're gonna come at us hard next week right uh they did it against barcelona and they sh they believe that they can do it against us uh but nonetheless you know uh, before the 10 minutes before the last 10 minutes of the game i thought liverpool was fantastic we played well mo salah is just an a football god uh, scoring two goals, setting up two goals. Uh, Mane, unfortunately, uh, uh, missed a couple chances early in the game. Uh, but nonetheless, you know, uh, we got to encourage him to keep going. And that's what he did. I mean, finally, he got his goal. Firmino was extravagant again, uh, scoring two goals. I was very pleased with his header. And that just shows you uh, how versatile Firmino is. Um, but Danny Ings coming in gave him a few minutes uh, to play, uh, but that doesn't change anything for us moving forward. But nonetheless, uh, it was a great game. I look forward to next week. Uh, I look forward to uh, an exciting game. I'm I'm just uh, I'm just nervous for next week again because we just take in uh, we just go there with a five-two aggregate. Uh, the game is not over yet, guys. The game is not over yet. And uh, if they didn't score the last two goals, I think I would have said the game is over. That's it. They done. But the last two goals in the last, in the last 10 minutes actually uh, changed uh, the perspective of the game going into Roma next week. But nonetheless, I'm happy for the boys. Well done to Liverpool. Well done to all the players. Well done to the fans and supporters. We're right behind the team. And we look forward to next week. Have a great time, guys. Um, I look forward to spending more time with you guys next week. Please like, share, comment on this post, and uh, let's move forward. Have a great evening. Bye.